Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tier, and I'm back with the, another video. I'm doing skincare. I want you to get unready with me. So, I just wanted to come on and just like be a little bit personable with y'all in the beginning because I'm going to make this a voiceover video just so I can get through everything a little bit faster. So, the video isn't so long because my videos have seemed to be like so long lately. But yeah, I just wanted to touch down in with y'all and let y'all know that. I really love you guys. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for coming back. And if you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, grab yourself a drink. Right now, I'm drinking some water with the Mio in it. And this is the strawberry watermelon one. It's really, really good. It tastes like juice and it's sugar-free. So you just get yourself a cup with some water in it. Put your cup of squirts of Mio in it. And I, I added ice to it. So yeah, that's what I'm drinking right now. And it's so good, guys, y'all. Keep yourself hydrated. Because you're going to need it during this summer. Alright, guys. So, let's go ahead and get to getting unready. First things first is to take off all the jewelry. Like, I remove it all. Like, I don't have any real gold or anything like that, so I don't really want my jewelry changing colors like when it's getting wet. And also just like to be comfortable, just take it all off, you know. We don't we don't want any worries with the jewelry. So just yeah, let take it all off, get comfortable, and set it to the side. Okay, honey, now it's time to take off this eye makeup and I always always use a micellar water this is the tart micellar water i always use a micellar water to take off my eye makeup because that mascara is just so hard to get off and i much rather get that eye makeup off with all the glitter and all that stuff get it off first before i start to like take the makeup off my face and i use this shiseido cotton swab uh, cotton pads they're so super soft and you get them from tj maxx and marshall's for cheaper than you would at sephora so i would look into that and it's just the best way to get off my eye makeup without having like eye makeup all over my face you know i like this step honey so get into it Next, I'm going in with this Pharmacy Green Clean um, Melting, I think it's Makeup Melter. It's so good. It's like so light on the skin. I don't know if you have ever tried the Clinique Cleansing Balm, but that is so thick and dense and oily. This one is nothing like that. It's so light, it's so airy, and it just melts all the makeup off your face. So I just take this and I try to do like a little massage, a little face massage when I do this part, just to get the blood circulating and flowing in my face. And this also just melts it all away. I go over my eyes again just to make sure that I got all that mascara off because mascara definitely is so hard to come off. You know it's like really really hard and I also um, double cleanse so this is my first step and then next I'm gonna go in with another cleanser but you guys will see honey did you subscribe yet like just go ahead and pause this video and subscribe so I've washed that off look how clean my face looks it looks so good but we're not done cleansing we're gonna go into this LMS superfood cleanser and I really like this I got this in a boxy charm actually and I like I didn't think I would like the foam but I actually do like the foam I do like this cleanser so I'm just gonna wet my face and then I'm just gonna cleanse my face like I would um, normally sometimes I go in with my uh, Foreo but I didn't have it today for this video I left it in the bathroom but so I'm just gonna go with my fingers and I just do the same you know how you wash your face so this is just self-explanatory here my cheeks have been breaking out like the bottoms of my cheeks have been breaking out so much so I've tried to pay extra attention to that part of my face when I wash it just you know just to get the breakouts gone you know that's what I'm doing. So the next thing I got is the Ordinary. This is their AHA and BHA peeling solution. This is like just an exfoliant. And I like um, AHAs and BHAs in my products because it's, it's an exfoliant, but it's not like a harsh like scrub, scrubbing, like making micro tears in your skin. This is just exfoliating, like chemically is what they call it. So this is good. So I rub this on my face and I let it sit on for 5 to 10 minutes and then I wipe it off. So this is going to sting. Like it's going to sting. 
it's gonna stop eventually but it's it, it's definitely going to sting so just push through fight through you can do it you can do it if I could do it you can do it too We need to get these lips right, so I'm going to go in with this Laneige Sleeping Mask, and this is the Apple Lime scent. It smells amazing. It feels amazing. I think all y'all know about this. This is that good ish right here. Y'all need that in your life. And you don't have to wear it to sleep. We could wear it all the time, like I do. So this is the Thayer's Witch Hazel Toner. So I use this just to cleanse, like an extra step to cleanse. You know, toner is supposed to balance your pH levels in your face so it's very good to use a toner after you wash your face it just gets your face balance back to a good pH state here's another very very good product this is the old Henriken Sin under eye banana cream and it is just amazing this is the best eye cream that i own like this is so good and i put that underneath of my eyes and also on my eyelids because my eyelids do tend to get dry um they're oily now but like sometimes they get dry and i'll have like dry patches and it just doesn't look good it's not a good look at all when you're trying to put some eyeshadow on so definitely keep your eyelids moisturized as well this is the SK2 Facial Treatment Essence. This stuff is expensive. <laughs> it's expensive, but it's very good. So what the essence does is, is it kind of softens that layer, that top layer on your skin so that the rest of the products you put on after go on much better. So it's basically making all your products work better. So you're getting your money's worth out of your products when you use an essence. So go ahead and research that so you can get the facts the tea and it's gonna make you want to buy yourself an essence too I make sure that I press this into the skin really good really nicely you see yeah it's a whole vibe it's a whole vibe don't reject your neck don't reject your neck always get your neck too so this is the briogeo be well this is the tea tree oil and i use this to, to spot treat my acne now this is very strong you you probably don't want to go in with this like this you probably want to mix it with some water or a carrier oil before you do this because it's very strong and it will sting but i just did it anyway you know i mean <laughs> I just did it but I'm telling you you're supposed to mix tea tree oil with a carrier oil or some water you need to dilute it somehow some way but I just went in with it sometimes I'll take a, a cotton pad wet it and then I'll put some of the tea tree oil on it and let it soak for a little bit to like mix in and then I'll wipe it like a toner over my face tea tree oil is antifungal so it's very good for acne so that's why I do this um, for my acne Okay guys, we made it to the best part ever, the moisturizing part. So this is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel. This is oil free and it's just like a nice thin consistency but it definitely makes your face feel so moisturized. This is the, the um, Drunk Elephant Bee Hydra Intensive Hydrating Serum and I mix the two together just to give me maximum hydration. Like you can never go wrong with hydration in your face and in your skin. So I mix these together and I just massage that in the skin and I try, try to press it into the skin just to make sure that it absorbs really nicely. And also get your neck, honey. Get your neck. It needs moisture too. So do that and push it into the skin. Make sure you push it into the skin, honey. This is the Dynamic Duo. I promise you, you won't go wrong getting this duo. So that was all the products for this video. And look at her. She's glowing, honey. She's glowing. Look at the glow. Follow these steps, okay? Follow them. And let me know what you think. Now to get even more unready, I'm taking out this hair. This is my little 
my little Sade vibe braid. I'm taking that out and it just feels so good at the end of the day. So just take your hair out and just be free. Take your makeup off, take your bra off, get in your pajamas, take a shower if you want to and just chill and be comfortable in your home. It just feels so good. So yes, I love getting unready. Alright y'all, that's it for my Get Unready With Me. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Those are the majority of the products that I use often. I do switch out some of them from time to time, but the majority of these products are the products that I use on a daily basis. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share this video. Leave me something nice in the comments. Alright y'all, until the next one. Bye guys.